get things done. That's impressive, and I'm not easily impressed. Dummy, thanks for agreeing to this interview. I'm really excited to get an outsider's perspective. Outsider? What are you talking about? I was like the main character of Saints Row 4. You weren't in Saints Row 4. What? It's already out. You weren't in it. Are you serious? We probably should have told him. He was just so excited. Couldn't bring myself to do it. Now I get what Dex is complaining about all the time. So what are we about to see? Well, after Zinyak gets killed, there's no one left to control the simulation. And in order to establish the order, the AI became sentient, taking the form of a dominatrix. Hence the name, Enter the Dominatrix. Yep, single entendre. Very clever. <sighs> anyway, the dominatrix takes control over Zinyak's fleet and abducts everyone. That's where we meet Donnie, who takes on a sort of guru role and teaches all of us how to bend the rules of the simulation. What was it like working with Donnie? It was fun. He's a really nice guy. So why did he get cut? Well, you figure me, Matt, and Donnie all kind of filled the same techie Mary Sue role. You only needed two of us to bigger, so Donnie had to go. Why Donnie and not you or Matt? Oh, Matt and I blackmailed the shit out of people. Enjoy the clip! Superpowers? <laughs> I can't believe you were able to train me with superpowers! Well, now we have to put them to good use. With Zinyak gone, the Dominatrix was able to become the dominant AI of the simulation. Dominant AI? Is that why she's called the Dominatrix? Not exactly. Come on, I know how to find her. I always thought I should have delivered that explanation about how she took over. Kinsey, you know they gotta share the techie stuff. Wait, we're not showing the training sequence? It was long and a bit boring. I don't think the audience wants to see it. But it was integral to the whole story on how I taught you all superpowers. And plus it had some of my best one-liners. Oh, I'm with you, man. I love my good zingers. That's not surprising. This is the area. Well, we Back for a little more playtime? What have you two been doing, Donnie? It's not what it sounds like. I have to admire that outfit. The fact that she agreed to wear it? Yeah, admire. Saints about to give this simulation up and maybe we might live. I get that's about to change, lady. Your face! Damn! She teleported away. You really think two of you can stop me? You really think it's just the two of us here? There's more. Well then, perhaps I should introduce myself. Who the hell is calling? Boss, oh, she's here and she's after me. I... Oh, damn it! Yeah, let me go! Fuck. The Queen of Latex just grabbed Shondi. Pierce, the Dominatrix just took Shandy. Like hell she did! She's chasing my ass down! Hey, I need help! I... Fuck! She also just took Pierce! She must have split herself into two copies. You go after Pierce, I'll rescue Shandy. Right. Good luck. Donnie always goes after the girl. Oh, whatever. Oh, come on. You know you like being the hero. Can we just focus on what's about to happen against the Dominatrix, please? Ah, oh, damn it! How come I had to be a victim and couldn't do the hero thing? I'm sure your day will come, Pierce. <laughs> okay, I am never letting you live this one down. Aw, oh, damn it! She locked me into this thing! Now get me down! Leave my new pet alone! Hey! Who you want your pet, lady? I ain't no one pet! Back up! He's not! Hey! Where'd she go? She does that. Who the hell are all these guys? We live to serve the mission. That's just not right.
leave without my permission. Then give me your damn permission! And give up this fun! <laughs> I don't think so. Keep away from the mistress. You are not worthy to touch her! This is just getting weird. All the people in this simulation are mine. You will bow before me. In your dreams. Fine, have this pet. The other one is far more enticing. Now, can you get me off this thing? Hang on. I think I've been hanging on long enough. Thank God. I don't even want to know where that rack's been. Donnie, good. You and Shondi all right? Yeah, about that. We need you to come rescue us. Both of us. Damn it, Donnie. Yeah, that wasn't much of a rescue. Hey, not my fault. I was just following the script. Sure, that's what it was. One woman BDSM to me. Easy for you to joke about it, Pierce. You weren't the one getting the crap kicked out of you. <laughs> I hear that's what can go on in those times. Besides, like you haven't fought off or it's people. Not when each remaining version of her gets more powerful as the rest die. It's actually pretty challenging. Shit, right. Forgot about that part. Why aren't you explaining that to the boss during the fight anyway? Isn't that your thing? Because I don't come in until after this fight, remember? No, shut up so we can get to that part of the connection. You will serve my every... Don't worry, I'll free you. At least someone can save us. Jeez, I said I was sorry. Saving you too now? What? No, I figured out a way to trap the dominatrix. That's why I love you, Kinsey. I'm at the power plant. Get here quick. Don't worry, boss. I'll keep Donnie safe. Thanks. Remind me why you didn't get kidnapped too? I'm too smart for her. And I was always kind of hurt the boss thought I would have fallen for some sort of trap to hold me hostage. Blame the writer, not me. That's no excuse. Actually, it kind of is. Whatever, you could have changed the script. Now quiet, this is the best part. Kinsey, how come the Dominatrix hasn't found you yet? I've been able to mask my signal until I had everything set up. I'm just that good. Fair enough. And the trap? I did. And it's totally brilliant. You see, I set up- Sorry! What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Which is when I figured out how she's splitting her code, and then I could force her into a single body inside me. 
Nope. Still talking. Oh, come on. Pierce, don't be a dick. Hold on. I think this is it. So the spider till she's weak, then activate the first node. Rinse, repeat. Got it? No problem. Good. Because I dropped the masking signal and she should be on her way. You freed my other patients, but I see you brought me a Keep away from my ginger. Um, thanks? We'll just see about that. Whatever this attempt is, it won't change the fate of the saints. Chief down. Go activate the first node. Do they know who I am? Grovel at my feet. That began isolating her duplicating code. Keep going. Again with your futile program. Hit the second node. Now, and I will let you spend the rest of your lives, sir. You'll watch as I grow this world in my image. Honey, you aren't that lucky. Think of what we can accomplish together with you as my favorite pet. End this program, and take your place under me! Start the next node! That's it! Only one more left! you think at this point the Dominatrix will run away or something. If you had listened to my explanation instead of skipping the majority of it, you'd know the nodes are also keeping her from escaping the area. Oh, right. What if your naughty librarian friend is wrong? What will you do if you fail? I offer you a chance to please me. Don't listen to her! Turn it on! So I can't see her why? It did. It trapped her in a single body. Uh, oh, Kinsey. So you've rescued your friends. What comes next? A lot of bullshit filler missions. I think there must have been like four escort missions in a row. It was so bad. Take Pierce to Terminal A. Protect Kinsey while she does nebulous task X. Guard Shandi while she drives to the widget factory. Uh, that was the worst. That widget factory mission was fucking painful to sit through. Worse than that Nightblade reboot. So anyway, we jump through an arbitrary number of hoops trying to track down this dominatrix, and lo and behold, we find her. In a sex club, how shocking. That was our idea. And I'm in this outfit, why again? To blend in. So why are you in normal clothes? Please. They know me here. So, well, how do we get the dominatrix? Her champion, Dom, is at his throne. Talk to him. Is everybody in this place named Dom? Yeah. You make that sound weird. Never mind. A dick 
chair? Are you fucking kidding me? You're dumb, right? I need to speak with you. The Dom recognizes the smartly dressed newcomer. Yeah, okay. I need to speak with the Dominatrix. If you wish to see the Dominatrix, you must prove your word. Tend to my animals. What do you mean, animals? The Dom's plushly adorned submissives. Put them back in their cages. Oh, dear lord. Fine. Time to cage some fetishes. Over here, fuzzy britches! In you go! I'm coming for ya! Two points! Come here, boy! Come here! Get in that cage! I'm coming to get ya! Get in your kennel! Have I mentioned how glad I am I am not in this mission? Where are you going, huh? Get over here! That's the solid! Your pets are all locked up. Where's the dominatrix? Not yet. You must now prove your willingness to please. Fuck me running. That's up to the client. You'll find him on the second floor. Make sure he is pleased. This isn't real. This isn't real. This isn't real. your world rocked. Come on, open up! Hold on! I'm getting ready for you, baby. Zemos? Oh, shit! I didn't know you were here. What? No, no way. Not gonna happen. But if you haven't gone pro, then why are you here? I need to speak with the dominatrix. Dom the Dom told me I had to, but... No. No. No way. I mean, no offense. Yeah, it'd be like fucking my cousin. Look, I say you did a good job. Just don't tell anybody you saw me paying for air. Oh my god! I wondered why Zemos and the boss couldn't look each other in the eye after this. All right, I'm done. We made a love, baby. Back so soon. I hope you got your money's worth, Zemos. Oh, yeah. I really like the way they use their painting. The Dominatrix only meets with champions. A chariot race is starting soon, and it's attracted the best racers in the world. Take out your competition and come talk to me. Take out some racers? No problem. on its skin. What am I doing here? I feel so...
think this needs new batteries. The razors have been wiped. So where's this race at? <laughs> oh, you fool. Those amateurs never stood a chance. You want to win the race? You'll need to defeat the doll. You bastard. You just used me to do your dirty work. You are a submissive. You are made to be used. Come, my submissive. Tend to your dog. Bring them on. You're all going down. I am through. You'll be begging for your life. I don't beg for shit, pal. Your insubordination will not go unpunished. You villains do- You may have defeated me, but you still have to win the race if you want to see the dominatrix. Zemos, to me! Man, this is bullshit. We ride! Welcome to the 31st Annual Pony Cart Invitational. Brought to you today by Leather and Lace. And speaking of Leather and Lace, they provided the head of the Saints and his pony with their outfits today. And what fine apparel that is, Zach. I have to say, though, I wish I had the figure to pull something like that off. Yeah, I hear you, Zach, but as good as it may look, I can't imagine that's very comfortable. Oh, indeed. I need to think how bad I'm going to tape after a long day at the track. Yeah, myself, I prefer the soothing touch of a poly cotton blend. Well, I've always been more of a satin man, Bobby. The way the fine weave caresses my skin is pure magic. My Rusty's new trombone has some heat! And another one bites the dust! More contestants have entered the track! And we got more ponies on the field! Oh my! Down goes Slippery Nipple! One less racer on the field. A tragic end for Rusty's new trombone. And here comes Hot Carlos with his steed, Nicky the Nag. Here, always a fan favorite. Hey, I'll be your pony anytime. And we have a winner. A great showing by the head of the Saints and his pony, Zemo. Yes, indeed. And that horse has definitely earned an extra carrot today. You rescued Zemos. What's next? The Dominatrix orders Paul to terrorize the city. 
and we need to figure out a way to stop it. It was our darkest hour, and despair was filling the saints. But Donny came forward with a plan to save us all. Let's not oversell it. He had us build a spaceship. As a team, Kinsey. As a team. You guys are at least showing a seven-minute QTE montage of us building the ship to fight Paul, right? Jesus! I didn't think getting a giant monster to eat us was going to be so difficult! I warned you Paul was dangerous! When I heard Giant Saint's flow can, I really didn't expect it to be that tough! Yeah, I don't think we doubt you now, Pierce. Where to? To Paul's brain. That's where our weapons will do the most damage. Hold on! This thing has a brain! What exactly have I been drinking all of these years? I'm contractually prevented from divulging the secret ingredients in Saint's Flow. Trust me, don't think about it, Simos. Just focus on taking Paul down before it's too late. Wow, what a view. I always wondered what my food saw when I ate. Some <laughs> people say I'm weird. say what those things floating inside Paul were? I don't remember that coming up. Oh, there's supposed to be stuff like ginseng, piranha, marine, all those types of ingredients you find in a regular energy drink. And what about those big polyp-looking things? Oh, those, uh, the, the, those are just, uh, stuff. Wait a minute. Didn't I see those before in a medical dissection video of a... Oh, look! We're almost to Paul's brain! This is it. If we release our payload here, it should cause a chain reaction that'll destroy Paul. Only one way to find out. I push the button, and nothing. Ah, the cargo hold's packed too tight. Um, try shaking the ship from side to side until they come loose. What'd you do? Just stop everything in there, Pierce? Fizzle stones and videos away! We have to get out of here before the whole place blows. Then how exactly do we do that? Head for Paul's top. Oh, good. At least the attempts escape from Paul was cut. about to see now is the grand finale. That's it? Look, I just don't think I can adequately justify what's about to happen. Would you say the President's assessment of the ending of Enter the Dominatrix is fair? If anything, they undersold it. It's batshit. I don't know, I think there's precedent. Totally. I'll put it to you this way. It was too crazy for Saints Row. Enjoy! <laughs> Alright, Zemos. We defeated Zinyak. 
but his death enacted the dominatrix failsafe that imprisoned us in a virtual world under the thumb of a leather-clad goddess. After a long, hard battle, it's all come down to this. Taking out the dominatrix once and for all. Nice summary balls. Total ad-lib. So destroying the dominatrix, that'll shut down the simulation? That's what they tell me, yeah. What happens if it doesn't? I don't know. But the show is hell ain't finishing. What we started up in that sex club. Hey, that was ten times more uncomfortable. Thank goodness you're here! We had to beat all the super I am a super Where is everybody, Shandi? Donnie split off. You free? We're on our way, Donnie. Shondi, Zemos, on me! Damn it! My flash is filling us. <laughs> the Dominatrix is none too happy with us. You got her running scared. You locked her into a single body, took out her champion, and destroyed her giant energy drink mold. What's she got left? Never underestimate a bitch used to be you know. Johnny, we're here. Things are getting fucking crazy, man. There's the dominatrix. Bow before me. Yeah, we're not so good at taking orders, honey. You will learn. happening.
The Zin are surrounding us. We need to do something. We're heading out, boss. Grab a gun. What the hell is going on? The Zin just came out of nowhere. It's insane. I've warned you people for years. But you're always, oh, Kinsey, that's crazy. You're going down, Zinyak. Kinsey, no offense, but you do say a lot of crazy sh- There you are, baby. I've been tearing this damn place apart. What happened, Zemos? The Dominatrix rebooted the DLC. Follow the Z. I know the way back. <laughs> I see your back. Enough of your parlor tricks, Dominators. This ends here. Impressive. But this battle isn't over yet. Where'd she go? We did it! The Dominatrix has fallen! Now we can leave this nightmare simulation! We better get a move on though! The way out is gonna close! What the hell? Who is that? More Zen? I don't know... It doesn't look like one of them... Get ready boss, it could be anything! Hold it! They're not attacking! Wait a minute. Is that That's right. Cut me out the mission. I brought the motherfucking cavalry. A dinosaur? Greetings. My name is D'Artagnan. I am an emissary of Cyrano, the king of a kind spacefaring people. <laughs> we are enemies of the Zen. Then you're a friend of ours, Brother Raptor. Well done, Pierce. I've... I've waited so long to hear that. The only way out is through a door at the far end of the simulation. We will help you escape. Climb on my back. We ride! Total <laughs> fucking <laughs> batshit. Hell, I'm just glad you're not riding me. woo -wee. Follow me, Saints! Out of the simulation and to the ending cutscene! We have to hurry! Come on! 
I will sing you the song of my people. Boom, boom, akalakalaka boom. Boom, boom, akalaka boom, boom. Boom, boom, akalakalaka boom. Boom, boom, akalaka boom, boom. Open the door, set on the floor. Everybody walk the dinosaur. Open the door, set on the floor. Everybody walk the dinosaur. It was now that this fight for me than years ago. I lit a cigarette, built up a monkey start to go. The sun was spitting fire. The sky was blue as ice. I felt a little tired, so I went by a big price. I want the dinosaur! I want the We Velociraptors are a proud people. In the beginning, we addressed the savagery of man by eating them. Later, we chose the path of enlightenment, choosing to leave their world rather than be brought down by their baser instincts. But, while humanity is capable of much cruelty, it is also capable of compassion, of honor, and the saints stand here as examples of that. Bring the heroes forward! We are in your debt, saints. What can Cyrano, the Raptor King, give to show you his thanks? A dinosaur with guns. Done. What say you, young warrior? Respect. People need to take me seriously. Any who questions the wisdom of Donald shall answer to me. Miss Kensington? Vengeance. You shall have it. And you, fairest Shondi? Cyrano, I want to be your queen. My hand, my heart, my kingdom, all belongs to you. Your subjects have named their reward. What can I do for you? You know, I'm pretty good, actually. Wanna go bowling, maybe? Yes. Yes, I do. My people, we cannot hide from the world any longer. We need to be a part of it, so that raptor and human can stand side by side in harmony. Let our new era begin!